Hello everyone, this is my Sangvi and I am back with another Kaunas Report Studio interview question. And in this question, interviewer is asking about how to schedule a report contains prompt. Okay, for this I created a very simple report. This report contains a list, a prompt and we are showing the value of the prompt here. Okay, and our this is a text box prompt and the, this is a required prompt. And inside our list, we have a query, go to query, and this query is filtered out by CT. And P underscore test is our prompt parameter. We are filtering CT based on the value inside the prompt. So let's run this. And our report is executed successfully. Now it is asking for the value of prompt P underscore test or parameter P underscore test. This is a required prompt, so that's why we have to select this. So let me quickly uh, select this and run my report, and my report is executed successfully. Now, what if I'm going to schedule this? Okay, so let me go on IBM Cognos connection. This is my report, schedule parameters query. Okay, so let me quickly go in properties and rename this because this is something. Uh, So I renamed my report name because it is a little bit confusing. Now we need to schedule this parameter is report. How to schedule, how to create a schedule for this report. You have two way to open your schedule wizard. First you can click on more and then you can select new schedule. Okay. And another method is go back on your Cognos connection, clean service and you can click this shortcut schedule schedule parameters report okay this is going to be open schedule wizard okay i am going to click on this and this is our schedule wizard and now here we can create a schedule for our report now i want to execute this report in every one say every one minute so i'm going to click on by day and i want to execute this report in every one minute so i'm going to click on this radio button this is going to be executed in every one minute right now the time is 11 20 pm so the next execution is around 11 21 so let me quickly go and click on ok and our schedule is created successfully and now how to check how to check when our report is going to be run for this i'm going to click on launch and ibm cognos administration And inside this, I'm going to click on upcoming activities. Right now, we have only one scheduled job. So that's why you are able to see the right now created our schedule. Okay. And if you have more than one schedule, then you have to find your required schedule. Okay. For us, this is our schedule parameter report, which is going to be executed on level 11.22 next execution is on level 23 and so on okay so let me quickly see what is the time and time is 23 22 12 so i think we need to wait for a few more seconds and if you and if you want to know the past execution then you can click on the past activity and something is right now executing then you can check on current activities so right now nothing is executing okay and if you want to see the past execution then you can click on this past activity and i think our report is executed successfully so not successfully our schedule is triggered successfully but our execution is failed why it is failed uh, for this i want to click on this arrow and I'm going to select view run history details inside this you can check the message okay this is the message the request has multiple error the query contains one or more unresolved prompt our report contains a required prompt so that's why our report execution is failed okay now let me quickly close this and I'm going to go back inside report studio and inside this I'm going to change it to uh, required to know i'm going to save my report 
and now we need to wait for next execution of our report so let me quickly refresh whether it is executed or not sorry i need to uh, click on pass activities okay we need to wait for the next execution current time is okay so i think this is going to be only i think this is already executed so let me quickly refresh and upcoming activities it is showing the time i think 11:26 and inside the pass activities our level 25 is already executed and again it is failed with the same reason the query contains one or more unresolved prompts okay no issue now how to schedule a report containing prompts okay for this you have multiple option the first option is define a default value for your prompts or for all the prompts okay so let me open my report and this is my prompt and i am going to create a default selection for this so check for default selection property click on this ellipse button and i am going to create a new value for this and i think this is the my default value london i am going i want to set this is my default value if nothing is set then use this okay click on okay click on okay and let me quickly change it back to required save this and run our report and our report is executed successfully with default value okay let me close this and let's see when our next execution is going to be take place so right now my time is 26 and it is going to be pick around 27 okay so let me go upcoming activities 26 oh i need to refresh my page past activities and right now the new execution is succeeded why because in this time our parameter contains default value so at the time of execution of report our prompt contains some default value that's why our execution of report is successful the next method if you don't want to open your report in kognos report studio and select every prompt and set default value then you have a alternative method the alternative method for this you need to open kognos connection for this you need to open kognos connection so i am going to uh, i don't want this cancel this is my report the second method i am going to set or define some value for my prompts inside the property of the report for this i am going to click on this this is the set properties click on this and now you need to go on report tab and inside this a uh, prompt value i want to set the values for prompt okay and this is our first prompt or only prompt and inside this i want to let's say amsterdam i want to select the value for this click on okay click on okay and let's see what is the time and time is 28 and i think our next execution is going to be take place around 1129 okay no issue so let me go back and refresh okay then i think our upcoming activities is upcoming activities is around okay so already 1129 execution is completed so i think i want to go on past activities and our 1129 is completed successfully now i want to see the output of this report for this i am going to go back on kognos connection and inside this i want to click on this view the output version for this report click on this and this is the output version i am going to click on this link to open my report in html format
so our report is now executed with value amsterdam our default value we set inside report studio is london so our default value is london and our value inside the property is amsterdam so our report is executed using amsterdam now you have the third method to set the values of prompt okay so let me show you the third method i want to close this view report output and for third method we need to click on this schedule and inside the schedule resort you have an option to define or overwrite the default values right now you are able to see the p underscore test amsterdam we set this value inside the property of the report now you can override it okay so i am going to click on this checkbox and i want to edit this and for this i am going to select uh, let's say let's say miami okay click on okay and finally click on okay and our execution is going to be our execution is going to be take place around 11:32 okay so for this i am going to go on ibm cognos administration I want to refresh this page. Our page is refreshed. So let's see upcoming activities. As for our timing, the next schedule is 11:32, and still it is pending. Okay, no issue. So we have to wait for a few more seconds. Time and almost. I think we need to wait only few seconds. Will past activities. Uh, I think we are not able to see the execution of 32. So let me quickly refresh my page for latest data. And I'm going to go, I'm going to click on past activities and here we have the entry of 1132. Okay, again, if you want to check the output of this, for this, we need to go back on IBM Cognos connection. We are going to click on this button, view the output version for this report. And I'm going to see the output of this. And this time our report is executed with the value Miami. So I hope now you are able to understand or you are able to answer how to schedule a report contains prompts or parameters. So that's it for this video. If you like this video, don't forget to click on subscribe, like button, leave your feedback, share it with your friends and see you all in next. Cognos Report Studio interview question video.